When monitoring things deeper into your network at the endpoint client level, you're able to collect even more valuable information. An example of this is with Sysmon and Windows operating systems. In this example in my Greylog instance, we're logging Sysmon events through the Greylog Illuminate Spotlight for Sysmon. This gives you detailed information of, and in the Windows endpoints, such things like recording hashes for image files, process GeoIDs for correlation of events when Windows reuses process IDs, GeoIDs for some logon sessions, logs for drivers or DLLs with signatures and hash values, raw read access to disk volumes and events from early stages in the boot process, and many others. Some, if not all of these, very well common, in fact, are those for looking for data in your logs for IOCs and hash values, looking for known and bad DNS queries and bad IP destinations. They're very common within these actual environments. Modifications of files and known directories or file names that are being modified in, in many different threat vectors. In this instance of Greylog, I've highlighted here the dashboards that are available specifically to Sysmon. One being an overview and the other three being the investigation drill downs for host, for process, or for user or login activity. This will highlight individual workflows and tracking those individual items one by one and in investigations. Mm -hmm. Next tab we're looking at here is the primary dashboard, the overview, and includes four different pieces of information or four different tabs within the dashboard. The first one is the DNS summary, showing you the failed DNS queries and successful DNS queries, and over time, and a variety of successful counts and their path, as well as the top 10 or rarest tens right across the board. The next tab, we've got a Sysmon endpoint activity summary, and this one gives you the endpoint types of events that are being listed and provides you a heat map for the top 10 endpoints and Sysmon types by host and the subcategories broken down as well. The Sysmon Network Summary tab is a tab that allows you to see the network connections that are created and processes and whatnot by Sysmon and its monitoring of those. So here you'll get the top 10 destinations by ports for the destination IP addresses and you can map backwards as to what's going on in your individual end client clients. And a Sysmon operation summary, which just gives you your hosts reporting, your Sysmon errors detected, and some events over time for the subcategory so you can get a good, a good snapshot of what hosts are being involved in the Sysmon data. Thanks for watching today and happy logging with Greylog.